Hey there, I'm back doing another stress toy review. I actually meant to upload one a while ago, but the video I took didn't come out very well. So I got a bit discouraged and didn't upload one, but don't worry about that. I have three things to look at today, actually. They're all squishy toys. Uh, the first ones we have, this is actually from a set of three. These are the Yo-Ya uh, Pull, Stretch, and Squeeze balls. And these have sort of a very thin rubber shell with a doughy consistency inside. Uh, this one, this actually comes with a set of three, the other one is at my workplace. So, and they seem to have a differing amount of air in them. This one has the most air, the green one has kind of a middling amount, and this blue one doesn't have any air. But you can see the seal has broken, it's got a very thin layer of glue on it. Yeah, so, the other ones have held up fine, but Definitely, if you want to get these, they have a very, very excellent doughy texture, and I really like them, which makes it a shame that this one has broken so early. I think they were about $10, so it's not that big of a deal if it breaks, because you do have two others. And they're not that expensive, but uh, that's just unfortunate that that happened. And the second ones, I just got these today, are the Sand Shapes from Abiliations. They've got three different shapes. There's a pyramid. Come on now. There's a pyramid, a sphere, and a cube. And these have a thicker rubbery shell with sand and air inside. And these have a valve actually, which can apparently be used to adjust how much air is inside. So if you don't like any air, you can take the air out if you have a little syringe. I don't have one, so. I can't do that. But yeah, these are from Abiliations, which actually is like a professional maker of toys for people with autism and ADHD who like to fidget. And they do make a sandy noise. They've just got colored sand in them. Uh, no leaks yet, but I, like I said, I literally just got them today. And the third one I'm to show you is the glitter bead ball which I've actually had this one for a little while and I liked it so much I actually got a second one I to keep it work and this is just a rubber ball like a rubber shell with beads inside beads and glitter this one like I said I've had this one for a few months now so it's gone a little bit milky which is to be expected but it still functions fine I think this one had a very small hole in it when I got it, but you can easily fix that with super glue and it hasn't sprung any other leaks. The seal has held up fine. I had to glue it a little bit, but it's overall been okay. And this one I like a lot. It just has such a crunchy feeling. There's no liquid in it. It's just got the beads and the glitter. And it's very satisfying to squish. The only thing I've noticed with this one is that it does stain if you leave it next to other toys. So be careful with that. It just leaves a little bit of a blue mark. It comes in other colors. There's also a purple and a green one that you can get. And unfortunately, um, as many people I'm sure have seen, Office Playgrounds closed, which is where I used to get most of my toys. You can still get them on Amazon uh, for the most part. And it's just a shame because I really liked Office Playgrounds and they had very, very good prices. But those are the only ones I wanted to show for today. In the event that I do get more toys, I will try to make another video in a more timely manner. But I can't say for sure when that will be. But I hope you enjoyed this one. Thanks a lot.